Hello! Today is the 7th of December and I've been a bit naughty this morning. I've opened the Christmas box again, but I've opened it because I wanted to share something with you and I wanted to share these Christmas cards. They're cards that our children have made over the years. Our eldest is 33, so some of them are really very old. And I tend to only look at them once a year. But when I do, they bring me joy. They bring back memories of Christmases past and cause me to stop and remember what the children were like as li when they were little, what their characters were like, the funny things that they got up to. And I look at them and, you know, I think what the children have grown into. This one, I look and I think of my daughter and who would ever imagine that she would dance on the stage of the new theatre in the Millennium Centre, that she would preach in church. This one, I look at and think, wow, who'd have thought that the boy who made that card would grow into somebody who could play the trumpet so beautifully and who can scale cliff faces like Spider-Man? The boy that made this card many years ago has grown into somebody else who, who plays an instrument. He plays the classical guitar and it is just awe-inspiring to listen to him. He also went on to, to guard generals in, in war zones. Who would have thought that? This one is made by a little boy who went on to run marathons, who won trophies in sailing competitions, who designs the banners that hang at the back of church. You know, they bring me great joy because they cause me to think of my children. You know, joy is a strong feeling. It's deep-rooted, inspired happiness. Joy is not transitory. It's constant. No matter what the circumstances are, joy is untroubled by them. The joy that I have from looking through these and remembering is not something that is affected by the situation we're in today. Joy is constant, it is untroubled. Joy is actually unreasonable. Why would I get joy out of a pile of old cards with glitter that drops everywhere and bits of dirty old cotton wool? But there is joy in these cards. Joy is unreasonable. C.S. Lewis, the writer of the Narnia Chronicles, said that joy is the serious business of heaven. And the Bible is full of references to the joy of the Lord. In Nehemiah chapter 8, verse 10, Nehemiah says, the joy of the Lord is your strength that joy that is deep rooted right in the very center of your being, that's unreasonable, that's untroubled and that's constant. That joy, the joy of the Lord is your strength. And I would pray that throughout this Advent, throughout the coming days and weeks and months and years, that you would know the joy of the Lord and that it would be your strength. 